When I saw a preacher the first time, I really even heard what the Bible said. But the rest of my life, uh, you're force fed uh, to have sex outside of marriage, to get drunk, smoke weed, to party, to live life to the fullest, be happy, do what you want to do. And so, uh, street preacher came to uh, the college campus and starts telling me what the Bible says for the first time. I didn't see it on the, on the YouTube uh, trending uh, page. You don't see it all with your Facebook friends. Uh, folks, because most people are wicked. The Bible says, enter on the straight and narrow road that leads to life, because broad is the way of destruction, and many go thereat. Uh, all the drunkards, all the porn watchers, all the sexually immoral, all the whores and whoremongers, all the adulterers, and the, uh, the sports idolaters, and the, and the uh, lesbians, and the trannies, and the uh, murderers, and the rapists. Uh, and the uh, fornicators. I draw the line that pot. And the, the pot, what? They smoke pot in Leviticus. Read the Bible. <laughs> What's the verse? What's the verse? Quote it. Hey, so the Bible in Leviticus. What much have they been burned as something to do with God? No, no, no. What's the verse? I'm looking at you, I don't believe you. What? You don't believe me? You believe the conscience that testifies against you when you watch pornography? You believe your conscience that goes off like a fire alarm? You say you don't believe in Jesus Christ. But you believe in watching pornography. Shame on you. You're going to find out that Jesus is real and you're not. Um, there's a project here and there's You believe in pornography, right? but you don't believe in Jesus Christ. Who's real? It's not you. Well, that's the flesh. The flesh tries to pull me to get to watch pornography, but it's, uh, you got to take up your cross and die daily. Uh, you know, that's the thing is, uh, I have to die daily to my flesh. There's still time. When I see a girl dressed modestly out of here, and that's pulling me in, I want to have sex with her, my flesh. But you got to take up the cross and deny yourself. That's the thing that's like, a sinner isn't even going to think twice about it. They're just going to try to have sex with that girl. They're, they're just going to try to have sex with her. They don't fear God. They're not a son of God. They're not a disciple of Jesus Christ. They're a sinner. That's the problem. I was a sinner. Now I'm not a sinner anymore. I have to deny my flesh. Take up